If you have a lot of imported medias, then what might happen is that it might become difficult to set them out. But no worries, Filmora gives you easy option to set out for the imported contents and arrange them in different ways. So in the previous lesson, we imported out video files, audio files, and images. And if you were to click on the project media, you see all the files together, as you can see right here. So now what you can do is, let's say you want to search out for a specific uh, video, you can just go around and type in the video uh, title right here. And you can see that I typed in pixel and all the pixel videos just pop up right here. Another thing that you can do to arrange out uh, the layout of the imported medias is by going over here and by you can go around and filter them by video, filter them by images and filter them by audio as well. So that's something that you can do. Over here on the right hand side, you can go around and set the view option. So you can go to list view if this is what you want and you can see some details as well as you can see right here. And you can go around and view it out by large thumbnail view, which is the default view. You can go for middle thumbnail views if you want more of the option. You can go around and pull ahead to see it, get more area just like this as well. So you can just go around onto views or go to small thumbnail view as well. You can go ahead and work around with sorting. So you can go for ascending or descending order of sorting right here. You can go around and enable sorted by name right here, sorted by duration. Uh, you can sort it by type right here. So if there's images and videos and audios, and you can sort it uh, by date created as well, just like this. And another thing that you can do is you can group by type as well. So just like this, if you had to choose group, you can see that now video, uh, photo and audio. Now they have turned into subgroups inside the folder itself. And what else you can do is you can go around, arrange it out with date created. So depending on when the video file was created, it get, uh, gets grouped out. You can go around by uh, group by camera name as well. So depending on which camera it took with, so if that uh, that's there. So in my case, it's none, so it's not showing anything. You can go around with duration as well. So this is less than one minute, while this is uh, one minute to five minutes right here. And those are the grouping and sorting options that are provided with Filmora to make it easier for you to access out the video contents. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.